children in this video we are going to discuss question number 5 of exercise 2.3 in this question you have been asked to give examples of polynomial px gx qx and rx which satisfied the division algorithm and one more condition okay there are different parts so in the first part the condition is degree of px should be equal to degree of qx now children before starting the solution you must understand what the question is you just have to give the examples of four polynomial only examples okay four polynomials you have to tell one should be px other should be gx another should be qx and rx these four polynomial must satisfy the division algorithm now what is division algorithm you know that division algorithm is px is equal to gx into qx plus rx that is dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder so children you must understand what is the meaning of this question now suppose you are asked to give any example of four natural numbers if you are asked to give example of any four natural number so you can just say any four natural number of your choice mm -hmm. but if a condition is imposed that the sum of say first three should be equal to the fourth one say tell four natural number the, so that the sum of first three is equal to the fourth number so first three to we can say any any number we can say like i have said for example 2 5 and 8 i have taken these three number but fourth number i have to think which what should be the fourth number because they have imposed a condition here that condition must be satisfied and what is the condition that sum of these three should be equal to the fourth one so i'll take the sum of these three 2 plus 5 7 7 and 8 15 so my fourth number has to be 15 first three can be any three but the fourth i have to think about it and then only write the fourth number so similarly you have to give examples of four polynomial otherwise so you can write any four polynomial but they must satisfy the division algorithm and a division algorithm is this and one more condition they have imposed ki degree of px is equal to degree of qx yani whatever px you are writing its degree should match the degree of qx px means dividend and qx means quotient now children when this happens when do you get the degree of px equal to the degree of qx this only happens degree of quotient will be equal to the degree of dividend when when the divisor is a constant polynomial constant polynomial means a polynomial like 2 3 5 they all are called constant polynomial because they don't have any variable with them see here if i am dividing 2x square minus x say by 2x for example i am dividing 2x square minus x by 2x when i start the division i will say with which number 2x should be multiplied to get 2x square so my answer will be x this is my question first first step check here the degree of dividend here is 2 but the degree of quotient is 1 they are not matching they will match only if i divide 2x square minus x by 2 if i divide 2x square minus x by 2 then how will i start with what number 2 should be multiplied to get 2x square and then i will get this x square here see my degree here of the dividend is 2 and the degree of the quotient is also 2 so this will happen only when we are multiplying by a constant polynomial so when they have imposed this condition so to satisfy this condition we have to take gx as a constant polynomial this we have to keep in mind okay this to we have to keep in mind but this is another condition extra condition they have given so this also to be kept in mind so if we want the degree of px to be equal to the degree of qx 
our gx that is the divisor should be a constant polynomial so i have taken gx as 5 now what about qx and rx so qx you can take any polynomial of your choice i have taken this here you can take any other polynomial of your choice also now comes the turn of rx when you are thinking of rx now so children you must keep in mind one very important aspect which you know about division ki whenever you perform the division the remainder is always less than the divisor and i told you the degree of remainder should be less than the divisor in the last video okay so you whatever remainder you are supposing rx its degree should be less than the degree of divisor now here because we have taken a constant polynomial so that is why i have taken one here you can take zero also here okay now px 3 i have selected i mean gx qx rx of my choice okay but px cannot be of your choice you have to satisfy the division algorithm so i have calculated px by using this formula gx into qx plus rx so these three i have supposed okay and this we have calculated how we have taken gx into qx plus rx so when i solve this i got 5x square plus 5x plus 16 as px so these are the four polynomial which satisfy the division algorithm and also this condition check here i got uh, i i i have taken gx as 5 and qx is x square plus x plus 3 the degree of qx was 2 and the degree of px is also 2 so their degree is same so this condition is also being satisfied okay so these are the four polynomial so children i have taken 5 here you can take any other number of your choice here and similarly in qx also you can take any other number of your choice and same is with rx but must keep in mind ki the degree of remainder should always be less than the degree of the divisor okay now in the second part <coughs> what are they saying in the second part ki degree of qx that is the quotient should be equal to the degree of rx that is the remainder so what have i done first of all first of all i have assumed these two only qx i have assumed x plus 7 again i'll tell you ki this i have taken you can take any other polynomial of your choice so because i have to keep the degree of qx and rx same that is why i have taken rx also x x plus 2 the degree of qx is 1 and degree of rx is also 1 so now comes the turn of gx mm -hmm. so as as you know ki degree of gx has to be more than the degree of rx so if i have taken the degree of rx as 1 i have to take the degree of gx greater than that so i have taken the degree of gx as 2 i have taken this polynomial again you can take any other polynomial but must keep in mind ki its degree should be more than the degree of rx okay and then i have calculated px again by using the same formula gx into qx plus rx so after the calculation i got this x cube plus 10x square plus 20x minus 12 so these four polynomials they will satisfy the division algorithm also you can check children you can divide px by gx to check whether we are getting this qx and this rx or not so you can do this uh, you can perform this division okay we this is px this is gx okay this is qx and this is rx so children this you just have to give examples of four polynomial but keeping in mind the division algorithm and the condition given in the question also okay